Oh yeah, so this is a short video on the uh, my new D5S, which is very cool uh, from one how. Um, and more importantly, uh, putting a glass bed on the um, on the stand. So uh, this is the bed that comes with the machine, uh, which is great. You put tape over it and print on that. Um, but I wanted to use a glass bed. I've had a lot of good experience with that before, um, and it's worked pretty well because I've managed to print the big vase. So if we uh, take the vase off. What we've got is a glass bed with some washers and uh, magnets on the bottom. Really simple, super glued on. So uh, yeah, really pleased with that. So um, what you've got is you've got the uh, obviously the new glass bed, um, and underneath here we've got um, some washers and some little magnets um, so these uh, posts are can you see that 8 mil so I've got some M8 washers oh. actually just a little bit bigger and um, the height of these uh, posts here are uh, five mil so these five by five magnets little uh, super strong little modulium blah 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 type magnets are great uh, and uh, quite simply all I did was um, get a stack of washers drop them over there get me washer put that on get some super glue put a spot on the back edge try and stay away from the middle there because you don't want to glue the washer on a little bit just tiny spot in three places and then literally just go uh, off of the glass up and drop it on now i didn't quite get it in the right place as you can see because the back washers are um, it's nearly off the end of the plate but hey ho um and then uh, do that carefully for all three positions Obviously, once the first one's on, then you've got to locate that and drop it down. And then when the second one's on, you've got to locate them both like that. And then drop the third corner down. But it's all the same right the way around. Um, so, yeah. And then uh, if you stick your 5mm magnets on, uh, they come down and it's located. And then you lock it down. And there's no movement in it, the magnets gripping and everything on just um, holds it perfectly fine. And then uh, all I've been using, um, some super hold, if you see that. Focus, yeah. Uh, there you go, freeze hold, salon finish. Um, so make sure this is perfectly clean. Um, clean it with some window cleaner type stuff so it's like squeaky clean and uh, give it a coat of that stuff and then uh, hair dryer it off and then give it another coat of that stuff and then hair dryer it off and then um, don't touch the surface print on it every couple of prints more of this stuff but you know be try to be very consistent you know nice even spray across the, the face and that's it really uh, and I've had lots of success uh, obviously just printing PLA because it's a cold bed um, but yeah I, I've had no problems whatsoever so there you go um, cool works for me uh, I've managed to print several times um, give it a go uh, maybe you can print something like this it's very cool I've got this off Thingiverse um, Amazed how work printed out. Uh, it's the first part I printed on this printer. So yeah, awesome. Um, so there you go. Hope you liked uh, the video. Um, if you do like it, please press the like button. It helps. And um, uh, subscribe to the channel because I'll be doing quite a lot more stuff with this um, in the future. I better do anyway because it's cost me a fortune. Um, so. Uh, there you go. Thanks very much. See you again next time. Cheers.